Welcome back. Well, as you've noticed, we finished uh, Blade Runner in the previous video. But, like I promised, I am going to show you some of the alternate endings that this game has and how to get them. Now, I'm probably not going to show all of the alternate endings. I'm at least going to show the ones that I know about and the ones that are reachable with the uh, state that my game is in. Because, as I explained uh, before, there are some things that are determined randomly at the start, like uh, who is a replicant and who isn't, and depending on that, some of these endings may not be possible to reach in uh, your game. I think I can actually get most of them. At least the um, significant ones. Now, the way this is going to work is pretty simple. I am going to take my main Let's Play as a baseline, and then simply show you what you need to do differently uh, from that Let's Play, from those, uh, from that sequence of events, to um, actually get the different endings. I can't guarantee that it will work for your game, again, because of the randomized um, variables, but um, I think most of my instructions should work. Now, the easiest alternate ending to get um, if you played the game like I did, which means you end with a um, replicant sympath uh, sympathizer ending at the moon bus, you know, just shot uh, crystal here, and um, now, if I go north here, Sadiq will question my loyalty, as he did in the normal ending, making me search for that uh, power thingy that's hidden here. Brother Man, wondering when you make it out here? Took a little while to realize where I belonged. The Maker built you right. What about you, Sadiq? Aren't you a killer? My woman? She'd be killed by a Blade Runner. Revenge all I got left. So yeah, I be a killer now. I understand. Truth be told, killing don't help much. The moon bus up and running yet? All it needs is fuel. Clovis wants to see you. Bring you back into family. I say, he prove himself, welcome back. One happy family. There got to be something around here, man. Old reactor cores. Anything still got a glow. The generator, it take almost anything. That's quite impressive, actually, that it takes almost any fuel. You can run on what? Orange juice and nuclear power or something. I don't know. Um, anyway, once you got here, you can actually decide to, uh, to change your mind. Think. Wait a second, I'm not a replicant! And, um... Well, shoot, Sadiq. And he shoots back. And he takes rather a lot of hits, so... <laughs> this is kind of a dangerous thing to do. But I managed to get away with it without dying. Which is good. Now if you do this, you go inside. Um, Clovis will mysteriously already be dying, even though he's not, if you uh, helped Sadiq, but anyway. And we'll get a different ending. I've been expecting you. They're all dead. You're the last one. I wish I could just leave. Just power up this ship and fly away. <laughs> but there's nowhere else to go. And no more time. You want me to feel sorry for you. And what about you, Ray McCoy? <clears throat> After what you did to my family, to my friends, do you not also seek forgiveness? I don't need to. <clears throat> I thought I could cheat my destiny. I should have cherished what little time I had instead of wasting even one precious minute on revenge. <clears throat> My hands are labored day and night, and ease 
comes never and he'll just go on reciting poetry. Life. You can no choose to shoot him or not, doesn't really matter. I never did like poetry. But, you know, I never did like poetry. Uh, actually, I do like it, but uh, apparently McCoy does not. It doesn't make any difference for the ending whether you shoot him or not. Also, I have to wonder what happened to Dectora, because I did leave her alive. <laughs> but she's strangely missing now. I see Steel didn't make it. I could have used you about ten minutes ago. You didn't need any help, McCoy. I thought it was all over when Steel showed up. I saw the corpse back there. I never thought she'd turn out to be a rep sympathizer. People are unpredictable. Chief Bryant wants to talk to you. He says you're really ready now. It never ends, does it? Uh-uh. You're a real Blade Runner now. Full retirement bonuses and everything. You've done a man's job, sir. How come I don't feel good about it? Who knows? Buy yourself another animal, maybe. A real one, not a Tyrell fake. She wasn't fake. Whatever you want to believe, McCoy. And it's Origami from uh, Gaff, of course, of a dog. I think this is by far the weirdest ending. <laughs> but then what did you expect? I mean, basically, you play the whole game as a rep sympathizer or as a replicant, possibly, and then suddenly change your mind. So, of course, the ending is going to be weird. So, okay, that was the first uh, alternate ending. But there are more to come. <laughs>